What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the rumors kind of swirling around the next Call of Duty, which of course is going to come out at the end of this year, so the end of 2021. There's been a lot of news over the past several months about Sledgehammer making this game. I've even made a few videos here on the channel about that. I usually don't like to make too many, you know, kind of leaked rumor videos unless it's got some pretty concrete evidence behind it. And over the last week, there's been a lot of rumor out there, a lot of evidence being shown, a lot of leaks being shown about Sledgehammer's next game being a World War II game again. Uh, this is pretty solid information. Now, you can always take it with a grain of salt. Anytime anything's leaked, you never know. It could change. But as of right now, it looks like the game's going to be called uh, World War II Vanguard. Uh, whether that name will change or not, who knows. There has been a lot of speculation of exactly what the game is going to be. Uh, you know, whether it will be a, a game that's set in the actual World War II era, that kind of style. Or will it be some kind of alternate reality style game that's uh, kind of an idea of World War II lasting longer than it really did. I'm not sure if that rumor is exactly 100% concrete, but we do know pretty, for a pretty good fact anyway that it looks like it's going to be another World War II game. Uh, they're also talking about it being on the Modern Warfare engine, so it looks like they're going to kind of... I'm not sure. It, a lot of people are going to say maybe a copy and paste, and it could be because once again we're getting into that kind of cycle where Cold War was made very, very quickly by Treyarch because Sledgehammer was kind of out of the picture and now Sledgehammer's being thrown back into it and they're not going to have the whole three years to make the game, of course, because they just have recently, as of last year, been hiring a lot of people for the studio. So it may be another couple of years before we really start to see the you know three-year cycle come back into the fold correctly, you know, like it really supposed to be where the dev teams actually have a long time to put some thought in and then fix everything and test everything before they release the game. We'll kind of just have to wait and see. I know a lot of people aren't a big fan of the three-year cycle. I know a lot of people are probably going to be disappointed to hear this is a World War II game. A lot of people may be really happy to hear it. Uh, I know um, the last World War II game Sledgehammer made, of course, uh, Call of Duty World War II, was either really loved or really hated by the community, it seemed. Kind of the same in the pro scene. They either really liked it or they really didn't. I'm kind of curious what you guys think. Leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. Are you excited to have another World War II game? Or are you kind of like, nah, I wish they wouldn't have done that. I wish they would have stuck with, you know, maybe the modern era or more of a modern era. I'm not quite sure how they're going to be able to continue to make COD year in and year out without either bouncing back between modern or older styles. You know, it's going to have to always be one or the other. But leave me a comment with your thoughts and tell me exactly what you think about all of these rumors. Do you kind of believe this is going to, the way we're going to go with the game this year? Do you think it's going to be set in the normal World War II era? Or do you think it's going to be something that's a little bit more maybe a futuristic kind of crazy idea of you know, kind of revolving around World War II maybe. Of course, if you liked the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.